So in getting these hooks operational, we need to open them up, place the piece on, and we're set, okay? To then sit down and do a lat pull down, this is how it should be performed. There is a leg piece here that we can see can be used to come down low and lock you in, or it can be used up top and allow to be not involved at all. You can choose the way you choose to use that. And then, having a seat, we grab those two handles. Now, as you can see, there are cable motion through to the weight, and that then pulls down. We want to set ourselves up with a neutral spine, shoulder blades down, otherwise known as depressed, and we want to retract our scapula or shoulder blades together. From this position, we keep our head back and straight, and we take the weight up to a slight bend in our elbows. We pull it back down to somewhere between nose and chin level generally in this motion, and then raise it back up again. That gets the most activation of your lats and other back muscles, and therefore getting the most out of your movement. If you do it slow and controlled, it minimizes the chance of any neck stress or injury, and I might as well add it in that 80% of the population are overactive in their upper, upper traps. So we'll do this back up, and in releasing, please stand up, gently lower the weight, and that's how we perform just one of many movements that can be performed on here. That being the lat pull down in that way.